The state's new corrections minister has warned there is no quick fix for the overcrowding in our prisons. Peter Malinowskis' comments coming as he unveiled a multi-million dollar upgrade at Yatlo. Designed for high-risk and special needs prisoners, the $14 million complex at Yatla has been almost four years in the making. This facility will relieve uh, some of the accommodation in our maximum security unit, often known as G Division. The building will also help corrections treat an ageing prison population, which is shaping as an ongoing challenge for the new minister. We've also uh, got to deal with that. Um, in combination with the fact that the prison population continues to grow. And with an overcrowded system, the union says the 38-bed wing is a welcome addition, but not the answer to our prison space problems. I'm sure the new minister would agree. Uh, we need more infrastructure put in place. We need, we need more beds. We are not going to fix the problem of overcrowding in our prisons overnight. Um, there are a whole range of variables that are contributing to a growth in our prison population. Peter Malinowskis may wish to move away from the so-called rack'em, pack'em and stack'em approach of his Labor predecessors, but the opposition wants to know how. It is a fact that at the moment when prisoners leave prison there is a 50% chance that that prisoner will return to prison. And the priority really has to be on rehabilitating prisoners while they're in the correction system because that means two things. It means we relieve the pressure on the prisons, but more importantly, it also means when people get back into the community, they make a con positive contribution. The High Dependency Unit finishes nearly $50 million of upgrades to the Northfield Prison Precinct, which have been completed since 2009. Rory McLaren, Nine News.